Now, I know it's been like three days since we've been able to upload here, and there's a reason for that. It's not me being lazy or anything because we're all quarantined, so I don't have nothing else to do. But it was some technical difficulties, but hopefully it's all fixed. And today, we're back with um every star's most difficult shot. Should be fun. As always, link is in the description to the original content creator. I cannot show enough respect and love to the people that are putting these compilations together because it's not easy. I can tell you that firsthand. It's not easy to do stuff like this. So, let's see what we got in this one. Starting off with D-Rose. Come on, man. That's prime Derrick Rose. Look at, bro, look at the difficult. Yes, that's, that's exactly. Hold on, hold on, hold on. That is exactly what a difficult shot looks like. You have one, two of basically the best shot blockers in their position. LeBron at the small forward and Dwayne Wade, one of the best shot blockers at shooting guard. And he goes up and under between the two over the... <sighs> what a go. Next, we had Dwayne Wade. Shot over the backboard. I remember this one. Lonzo couldn't keep up with him. A terrible shot. But if it goes in, it does not matter. If it goes in, it does not matter. Of course, this is later in his career. This is like, what, a season or two before he retired? Come on, man. Look at James Johnson. Look at James Johnson on the bench. Please tell me y'all saw that. Hold on. Quick rewind. Zoop, zoop, zoop. James Johnson's face right here. The man is like, I can't believe he took that shot, and I can't believe that it went in. DeMar DeRozan. Actually, DeMar DeRozan has a lot of very difficult shots in his career. Oh, do they count that? That could win. Yeah, they counted it. Continuation. Oh, my God. Seth Curry got the ridiculously high layup, but that was different. Oh, Kimba. Oh, oh, my God. Okay, I'm seeing clips I ain't never seen before. Yeah, that's crazy. So, I want y'all to keep counter of how many of these shots are luck and how many of these are skill. Honestly, that's a lot of skill. I ain't saying that's luck. I, I think that's Kimber Walker's skill right there. Anthony Davis is a victim of another one. Mm. Mm. He was fouled there? We called that as a foul? What was the foul at? I don't think the man was touched. Cal Lowry. Mm. I'm guessing we'll probably see a lot of end of quarter buzzer beaters because, I mean, you just throw shots up at the end of the quarter. Like, that's not even a jump shot. He literally just threw it over his head like, like this. You know what I'm saying? He just fully threw it over his head. So it's not even really a jump shot, but it went in, and it counts as three. It counts as three, and that's all that matters at the end of the day. Boogie. Oh, my God. Some of you younger boys don't remember Sacramento Kings boogie. Now he ain't never won nothing. <laughs> he ain't never won nothing now. But individually, the type of stat lines this man was putting up in Sacktown is ridiculous. They never put a team around him. Blake, 360 layup. Come on, man. That's that's in the playoffs. That's in the playoffs. They were up by 20, so if he missed that shot, there's no harm done. But like that's in the playoffs, dog. John Wall. Oh, John Wall's got a lot of different shots, too, man. This man is ridiculous. Come on, Mike Dunphy. Bad foul. Bad foul. He hit the, he hit the flow kind of hard to keep it a buck with y'all. Yeah, look at this Bulls team, man. Tony Snell on the court. DJ Augustine. I'm good. Oh, it didn't count. Oh, it didn't count. But look at the situation. There's six seconds left in the game. That's like a dagger if they count that. That's a dagger if they count that one. But they didn't. Wow. Wow. Klay Thompson game winning fadeaway. Mm. Mm. That's a, yeah, that's a small George Hill. That's knowing the situation, knowing the matchup, Klay Thompson. What a move. What a move. Wrong leg kick and everything. That is a very difficult shot. Most the same one on the list from Paul George. But why, though? Oh, he was trying to draw the foul. He was trying to draw the foul. And it goes in. Oh, man. Okay, now that was probably the first one on his list that was like 99% luck. He wasn't even really looking at the rim. He wasn't really even looking at the rim. We counted that as luck. 
Jimmy Butler hits Banks shot while falling down. That's up there. That's up there for sure. Jimmy Butler in the playoffs, leading 3-1. This is the series where Mike Dunleavy got pushed by, by Giannis. Giannis lost his temper in the elimination game. Pushed Mike Dunleavy to the crowd. I'm like, man, Giannis, where does temper come from? We ain't seen this from you. We haven't seen this from you, Chris Paul. 360, no-look layup. Oh, man. Oh, man. I think he needs him dunking in the uh, your digs. But, oh, man, that's crazy. And that wasn't the only crazy shot Chris Paul hit over Tim Duncan. If you know, you know. If you know, you know. The spin that was on that ball is ridiculous. I wish I could rewatch all of these games in HD. Because I would. I would rewatch all of these games. Because if y'all don't remember, um, he ended up second or third in, in the MVP race, by the way. Just saying. Chris Paul was that man. Dame. Count him. Count them. He sent these boys home this series, man. Don't forget to <laughs> call it for the ball. Pull up. Wow. Look how young he is in these videos, man. This is like super young. This is like what? Year two, year three, Damian Lillard, maybe? Mm. The fact that it's in the playoffs and it's a close game makes it makes it even better. Step back. Joel and B. I mean, yeah, that's difficult, but like. I think everything Joel Embiid does just looks very seamless because he is so big. You know what I'm saying? But yes, that is a definitely a difficult shot. Kyrie Irving got a lot of these. Oh my God. Oh my God. I mean, they're down by 3,800 points, but that's a nasty shot. And that's like rookie Kyrie. Y'all see how babyface that man is? How babyface Anthony Davis is? Grievous Vasquez is on the court? Yeah, that's baby babyface. Russell Westbrook off the back pass to himself. Oh my god. Oh my god. Count it. Count it. Okay. Okay, Russ. Go ahead and get you a bucket then. Off the back of Rodney Hood gets it and throws it in. That's prime. Uh, I ain't got no teammates, even though KD was on the court. Kawhi in the finals, game seven. I mean, y'all know how this game seven ended, don't y'all? I think y'all probably do. I think y'all probably do remember how this game seven ended. What a move. Kawhi. Come on, man. Two-time finals MVP. Two-time finals MVP. Kawhi Leonard. Giannis. Mm. Bro, I'm telling you, some of these dunks that Giannis does, his arms just keep going. Like, come on, man. His arms just keep going. There's no reason for him to turn into a lasted boy and do this. Stretch Armstrong. His arms just keep going. And one floater from James Harden. Mm, for sure. For sure. Got a text from my Dukes. So we have to take care of that after the video. But and one, James Harden. Anthony Davis, double clutch buzzer beater. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Come on, man. I can't wait till he's doing that in a Chicago Bulls uniform next season. You know what I'm saying? I mean, a man can only hope. A man can only dream, right? Anthony Davis. Ah, oh, nasty. Quincy Pondexter on the court. The man just never really had a team. I mean, they got to the playoffs a couple times, two times to be exact. KD, difficult four-point play. Oh, man. Oh, what a bad foul. Oh, that was no replays on that one? Okay. Seth Curry, one-handed three. Throw it up there. Mm. Mm. That's nasty. That was a foul, to be honest with you. He got, look at, look at the body check. Look at the body check right there. And he throws it up and it goes in. Fade away off the backboard for the... Oh my God, Bron! Oh my God! Knowing the situation, knowing there was one second left, throwing it up there and getting it in. That's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. No look fadeaway over Vince Carter, Allen Iverson. Mm. Mm. Really didn't even look at the rim. Really didn't even look at the rim. Flipped it over his shoulder. 
Oh my God. He heard the whistle. He was like, I got to go up with it. So I can get me some free throws and boom. It's knowing the situation. Kobe. Oh man, Kobe. Rest in peace, man. Jesus Christ. <laughs> this is why Kobe was great, bro. Rewatch this clip. Let's analyze this game tired from Kobe. Whoever this is, I can't tell, is wide the heck open from three. Wide open right there on the wing. And Kobe just throws it up there and it goes in, man. The, the B. Come on, man. Oh, my God. That's an amazing defense. I can't tell who that is, but that's amazing defense. It, it don't get, You can't play better defense than that. This is better. Oh, Jordan. Oh, my God. There's no reason for him to stay in the air for as long as he did. That's a bad man. Wait till that documentary come out, y'all. Wait till that documentary come out. That's a bad man right there. Jeez. And that's the end of it. Thank y'all so much for watching this one. I'll be back. Peace.